the rap game is 25% music and 75% image and personality and vibe also. That's why artists like Ice Spice gets promoted, gets pushed out in everybody's face, and there's more talented female artists who get overlooked. Ice Spice gets her props. Use G's get his props. D Thang get props. K Flock get props. But the one artist with the biggest hits that gets overlooked is B Love. B Love My Everything might be the biggest TikTok song ever, if not top five biggest TikTok song ever. B Love, if you know, you know, might be the best sample, in my opinion. That's my favorite Brock Strill song. He got Brotherly Love and mad other little small songs that are, they might not be hits or nothing like that, but they're very popular songs. He basically has no misses. And he has a lot of content out. He's not one of them artists like Ice Spice or something that got like one song, two songs, four songs out. The nigga has music out, music videos, streams, all that kind of stuff. He basically the biggest Bronx drill artist of all time, but he just continues to get overlooked. In my opinion, he just just doesn't have the personality, man. He's more like a quiet, reserved, laid back kind of guy. Most people won't like him. Most people won't hate him. He's just there. And that's okay because even though right now music is 25% of everything and your, your, your image is 75% of everything, when it comes to longevity, it gets switched around. Music becomes twenty. Uh, music becomes seventy five percent, and image becomes twenty five percent. That's why you see artists like Kendrick Lamar and J Cole when they first came out. They didn't have the image or the personality or nothing like that, but they put that art out and it lived. And once that shit lived, you're you're cemented in the game. Your image will not make you a legendary artist. Your music will. Your music will make. Your music is what keeps people in the game. For years and years to come you could come out with a hot image and all that shit but if your music is not there you will be here and going tomorrow now be love he he does continue to get overlooked but he keeps dropping bangers he keeps dropping good music as long as he keeps doing that it will catch on and he will be in the game for years and years and years to come he'll be one of them artists that when people think new york they think be love all you gotta do is keep putting out the content man that's it Keep consistently putting out mixtapes, albums, whatever. Keep putting out good music. Your shit will live on. They overlook him. In my opinion, he's the most talented. Digital Thugs, I'm out. Like, comment, subscribe. Is B-Love overlooked? Is he underrated? Is he overrated? Is he trash? Is he fire? Let me know what y'all think, man. I'm really curious about that.